Hi all, and welcome back to my channel. Uh, Courtney from the beginning has been producing TV and movie related die cast cars. Uh, for example, you got like the Kojak Buick, Star Starsky and Hutch car, the Monkey's Mobile, and of course you got the famed DB5 and Lotus uh, from James Bond. Now here's one that I'm not too familiar with is the Ford Sierra from the TV show Spender. I love most TV dramas and comedies uh, uh, by uh, from Britain by BBC, ITV, such as that, but I've never heard of Spender. Uh, now you're all wondering what is Spender? Well, good question. According to Wikipedia, Spender is a British television uh, police procedural drama created by Ian LaFemme and Jim Nile. First broadcast was on January 8th of 1991 on BBC One the series which also starred Nail as a as the character ran for three seasons between 91 and 93. Finished with a feature length special The French Collection. Bradcott broadcast on the 29th of December 1993. A total of 21 episodes were produced. The first and second series were produced by Martin McKinn and the third series was produced by Paul Raphael and, and uh, Peter McAlsey. Uh, the series itself was set uh, in Newcastle, focused on the life and exploits of Detective Sergeant Freddie Spender who is often chosen to carry out more during police cases. So that's a bit of a synopsis, as you can see on the screen. I've got the, kind of the Wikipedia article up there. Uh, if you would like to know more about it, please look up Spender TV series on Wikipedia, and it'll be able to let you know more about it. Now in front of you, of course, is the Corgi Classic Spender Ford Sierra. As you can see, it's it shows you the, I guess a spender, uh, kind of the scene from the TV show. It's in 136 scale, which is the largest scale, and Corgi likes to do that fit in the box. It's model number 96012, and as you can see. It's in uh, really good condition. Now, this vehicle was given to me a few years ago uh, for Christmas from my brother-in-law whose uh, dad passed away and he had a small little collection of die cast. And this is one of them that was gifted to me to be its tender. And I am grateful to have it. So why don't we take it out of the box, take a closer look at it. Now it's a typical corky box. And you open it up, pull it out, and it sits. Now they have a interesting way of kind of keeping the car in there, these plastic clips. They do sometimes tend to get stuck into the wheels, I've noticed, so you sometimes have to fight them out. But what it does is also it bends the box really badly. But that is the car. I'll move this stuff out of the way. We'll cut the straps so we can see what features it does have. And there's that. I'll reposition my camera so we can get a better look. So here is the the Ford Sierra from the TV show Spender. As you can see it does have open doors on dog leg hinges which I guess is kind of typical for that time when these cars may have been produced or at least this die cast and it does have the hood opening so it is actually a big lump of black plastic with really no kind of real char characteristics 
the underside is I guess pretty basic for that time. It's a Sierra Sapphire. The interior is See if we can get a closer look at it. Nothing too spectacular. But it does have a bit of suspension. It could be just the the metal on it, but you know it's your typical corgi made to fit the box kind of a car. Nice uh Nice kind of rim look and tires on it. It is separately applied. <coughs> Lights. Front and rear. Nice little four logo. Of course, you got the license plates. But other than that, it's nothing too overly spectacular of a car to see. There's you know, yeah, shut lines on it are horrible, as you can see here. <clears throat> so it wasn't, you know, in the, the big brutal gaps everywhere. It's nothing too spectacular of a car, but <clears throat> it will be placed on display in my collection. Well, that's it for this video. Uh, thank you very much for watching. And if you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe and leave me a comment. Thank you and I'll see you in the next video.